I'm Raj Patel, I lead the acoustic consulting team at Arab in the Americas and I specialise in the design of performing arts buildings. Arab Acoustics created the Sound Lab 10 years ago as a tool for acoustic design. It was created from a desire to be able to work more closely with clients, primarily musicians, musical directors, architects, as a tool that allows us to listen to buildings before they're built rather than using technical jargon and complex wordy reports to describe acoustics. The process used in the Sound Lab is called oralization and it allows clients to listen to the acoustics of a space before it's built. It's the oral equivalent of a visual rendering in architecture. There are two essential components to the process that we use in the Sound Lab. The first is that we have to capture the acoustic signature of the room, which we can measure if the room already exists or we can predict in a computer model of a building that is in the design stages. The second component is to have sounds that are recorded completely in the absence of all sound reflections, often referred to as anechoic sound. We have some library recordings, but we have also commissioned recordings by orchestras in anechoic chambers to capture sound for this purpose. The Sound Lab uses a system of 12 loudspeakers arranged on a sphere that takes the oralizations and reproduces the exact timing, strength and direction of the reflections as you would experience them in a real room. The oralization process combines the anechoic sounds with the acoustic signature of the room and allows you to hear what the music will actually sound like when you're in that room, either as an audience member or as a player in the orchestra. We have sound labs in all our major offices around the world. Each of the sound labs has access to the data from all of the others. This allows us to share information on our projects with each other and learn from each other's designs by listening, which is an incredibly important part of designing buildings. It also allows us to work collaboratively with clients, with architects, with artists, with performers, with musicians, so they can understand how their environments will sound from the outset of the design process. And it allows subjective decisions to be made about acoustics by the whole design team in a very inclusive way.